With Shiba Inu coins sitting around that 2600 point per coin range, I know a lot of people were anticipating a price move to the upside, especially after the announcement of the metaverse. Guys, the Shiba Inu coin team really likes to get everybody excited and hype people up. And, and you know, sometimes it does leave people down, but there are so many good things to talk about with this metaverse. I do want to say that we're going to be talking about the good and the, the reasons that we could see Shiba Inu coin moving higher because of the metaverse especially after seeing everybody arguing on social media about the fact that it's like a, a dead end it's absolutely not but also i do want to say that there is going to be another live ask me anything on twitter spaces today i will be hosting it on the youtube channel and we're going to be live at 2 p.m eastern time so do the conversion wherever you guys are at it is going to be hosted by binance us guys this is going to be a big I mean, it's a big AMA when you've got a centralized exchange the size of Binance, uh, I guess, hosting the AMA. And hopefully, I don't know if we're going to get any new information or not, but hopefully we do. So be there, tune in, and listen if you guys can, 2 p.m. Eastern Time today. And we're going to talk about all of the good things surrounding the metaverse. So if it sounds like something you're interested in, let's get started. What's up, everybody? I'm Clay. I'm here to make 2022 the best year ever. If you haven't clicked that subscribe button, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Join us. Become a bro. We are here every single day, and we are growing our portfolios together. Look, if you're brand new to investing, you don't know how or where to buy stocks and crypto, you got a link in the description for Weeble. Super simple to set up your account. Any deposit is going to get you guys some free stocks. Any $1 crypto trade gets you your choice $5 in free crypto. And then if you want crypto exclusive exchanges, you've got those down there as well. But let's talk, you know... Okay, just r briefly, let's just intro that, that Ask Me Anything. It's going to be by the Binance team. It's going to be at 2 p.m. Eastern Time. If you guys do want to watch it, but you're not on Twitter or anything like that, I will be hosting it live here so you guys can kind of, you know, chat around. If you don't want to watch it on Twitter, but you have access to, you can still get in the chat room and, and see what's going on and throw your ideas back and forth in there. So we will be hosting that today at 2 p.m. Eastern Time here on YouTube. But I want to talk about the metaverse because I see things, man, I see articles about the the guys over at Dogecoin making fun of the uh, the YouTube metaverse. No, not YouTube metaverse. The Shiba Inu coin metaverse. I see people in the Shiba Inu coin community kind of, you know, throwing their frustrations around. And in look, there's not going to be any one kind of catalyst that Shiba Inu coin that the developers can do to drive Shiba Inu coin higher in price and just and you know make it soar. What we saw back in October, the rally that we saw back then, the rally that we saw back in May of 2021, was simply excitement. FOMO buyers, people excited about Shiba Inu coin, and I absolutely believe that that excitement can return. We just have to wait for money to flow back into crypto. We did a video yesterday, and I talked about India and the fact that India's tax rates on crypto were changing, and that could have caused some confusion and caused some selling in the overall crypto market. And and as of today, you know their tax brackets are different now, and we could see people flowing back in across the globe. You've got people wondering and worrying all over right now about how crypto in general, not just Shiba Inu coin, but how crypto in general is going to be taxed and regulated and so on moving forward and anytime you have that uncertainty you're going to have safe money that's afraid to be invested in that risky asset but the Shiba Inu coin metaverse guys it's good for a variety of reasons and yes it is going to include Shiba Inu coin now I see some of the frustrations talking about well you got to own leash yes you do have to own leash if you want priority access uh, I don't get it. I, I don't get it, right? I, I'm not an advocate of owning all of these things to give people priority access and things like that. If you want priority access, be available. You know what I mean? Like, like show up on time to buy your lands. Just let everybody get in. If they can't, if they can't afford it, they can't afford it, man. If they can't buy it, it because they're not available, they're not available. But at least they have the same opportunity to go out there and spend their Shiba Inu coin, not their Ethereum, not their Leash, not their Bone, and so on. Spend their Shiba Inu coin to go out and buy it. Now the counter argument to that from the development team is that if we require Shiba Inu coin to be used as a form of payment people will buy shiba inu coin and then dump their shiba inu coin when they no longer need it in order to go get the lands creating some sort of a pump up and then a dump afterwards maybe 
Okay, maybe. That's the best I'm going to give them is maybe that happens. Maybe it creates enough demand to see the price pump up. Maybe it creates enough selling pressure to see the price dump back down. But that's the excuse they're using. The, you know, people people say that it, it creates no utility for Shiba Inu coin. One, it's called Shib the Metaverse. So everybody is going to get the vibe that is Shiba Inu coin centric. It is going to be a massive marketing strategy. It's going to be a massive immersive experience. And it's going to be centered around the Shiba Inu coin dog and the Shiba Inu coin ecosystem. We have to remember the, the development team, they can't change Shiba Inu coin. That contract has been locked, rescinded, thrown away. They are done with it. The only thing they have control over are these ecosystem coins and, and things to build around Shiba Inu coin. It is hard to remember that sometimes, but they have no control over Shiba. They only have control over the things that they can build around Shiba. And I do believe they're trying their best to do that. Now, as far as creating utility in a sense that you're going to be spending Shiba, I don't know if they're going to go down any of those directions, but burning Shiba is another major concern. Now, here's what this is a this is a double-edged sword, okay? I want to say the pros and cons of the Shiba Inu coin burns that are going to be going on in the Shiba Inu coin metaverse. If you burn these coins, you will be renaming your land. You will be burning Shiba Inu coin, but you will be paying for it. It will be burnt out of your pocket, out of your wallet, and out of your Shiba Inu coin holdings because you're the one that is paying to rename your Shiba Inu coin lands. So yes, they are allowing people to burn Shiba Inu coin on a hundred thousand plus different plots of land. So we could see, you know, potentially if I believe it was Shib Queenie did the math. And if we have anywhere near the same burns that we saw on Shiboshis, which were 8 billion coins being burnt, we could have 80 billion coins being burnt on renaming plots of land in the metaverse. That's huge. You know, that will be the community burning. It's not necessarily a developer or, or some sort of uh, development tax. But at this point, guys, even if they do implement a development tax, it's still going to be coming out of your pocket because you're going to be taxed on the transaction. So it's not like the developers have some development wallet where they're just going to go burn all of their money or anything like that. You know, it is going to be a heavy reliance on the community to do so, but it's a step in the right direction, man. Nobody can come out and, and move a multi-billion dollar asset overnight, shoot it to the stars, let you get back out, and then watch the, the price of the coin crash back down. We need to remember, if we want to see Shiba Inu coins succeed, we need to see Shiba Inu coins succeed over the long term. I'm excited about everything the metaverse has going on here. I hope that you guys are excited about everything the metaverse has going on here. I absolutely think it's got utility, but I want to know you guys' thoughts in the comments below. So let me know down there. If this button's still red, make sure to click it, subscribe to the channel, join us, become a bro. We are here every single day, and we are growing our portfolios together. Claybro883 on Twitter and Instagram. We will Binance Gemini, Crypto.com. Until the next time, hope that each and every one of you have an awesome day.